find the value of m such that the integration, the definite integration from m to 2m of 2x plus 5 over x squared plus 5x dx is equal to natural log of 3. So what they're saying is you want to find the value of m uh, if the definite integration of this function is equal to natural log of 3. So let's first integrate. Uh, okay, so let's do the whole thing like this. So the integration from m to 2m of 2x plus 5 over x squared plus 5x dx is equal to natural log of 3. So well, this is a rule that would be given in your formula sheet. The integration of f dash x divided by f of x dx is equal to natural log of x plus c. Now because this is a definite integration, you don't need to put c because uh, c gets cancelled by when you substitute the lower bound and the upper bound. So here, if you look at this function, the denominator, the differentiation of x squared plus 5x is 2x plus 5. So well, you can say, you can set, you can, you should be able to see f, f dash x is equal to 2x plus 5 and f of x is x squared plus 5x. So just using this formula, well we can say this is, this implies natural log of f of x, I should write f, f of x here, natural log of, not x, but f of x, natural log of f of x plus c. This should be there in your formula sheet. Okay, so this is natural log of the f of x, which is the denominator, which is x squared plus 5x from m to 2m is equal to natural log of 3. So now substituting the upper bound and the lower bound, we can say this is natural log of if you put 2m here, so this that's going to be 4m squared plus 2 times 2m is going to be 10m. Take away natural log, if you put m here, that's going to be m squared plus 5m is equal to natural log of 3. So using log rule, log of something take away log of something is this divided by log of this expression divided by this expression so well you can this is same as natural log of 4m squared plus 10m divided by m squared plus 5m is equal to natural log of 3. Now natural log of something is equal to this, so this expression has to be equal to this. So well, now you can say 4m squared plus 10m divided by m squared plus 5m is equal to 3. So cross multiplying or multiplying both sides by m squared plus 5m, you get 4m squared plus 10m is equal to 3m squared plus 15m. Now taking away 3m squared from both sides and taking away 10m from both sides, we can say, well, m squared is equal to 5m. Okay, so now let's make it a quadratic. So this is m squared minus 5m is equal to 0. You can factor the m out. So this is m minus phi is equal to 0. So well you can say m is equal to 0, m is equal to phi. So let's check whether the, both the answers make sense. So what we are saying is, if you put 0, uh, 0 to 0, integration from 0 to 0 doesn't make sense. Okay, so if you put uh, 
zero to zero if you put zero here uh, yeah so you can't have uh, from zero to zero so the only answer which is possible is in this context is m is equal to five okay so let's check okay so what are we saying is integration of natural log of 2x plus 5 divided by uh, from 5 to 10 it should be natural log of 3 so how to check this I'll show you how to do this on the calculator so if you go to the run menu option and if you go to uh, calculus if you go integration and you type in mm, let's start with a bracket 2x plus 5 divided by open bracket x squared plus 5x close the bracket and now you have to put a comma so your m is 5 comma 10 so this is basically telling the calculator find the definite integration from 5 to 10 of the integral 2x plus 5 divided by x squared plus 5 and go equal this is 1 point whatever and if you go to check your answer that should be equal to natural log of 3 so if you go natural log of 3 should be the same answer so your answer is right okay so this is how you can use integration on option key to check any definite integral